Alrighty, welcome back to another video. So, this is what has happened right after the troop portal, uh, the legendary troop portal has uh, showed up in the servers, in the public servers, and we found our first. Well, it's not really the first. I mean, I, I did test uh, what happens when you deal with five uh, legendary troops in the. Uh, on the same defense, but right now this looks like a very How do you say? Um, a very common defense that you'll see on in wars mostly So we're gonna try to take this on um, I just want to show you what the uh, Values the stat values are like for these kind of heroes you're looking at Timius, you're looking at uh, double costume triple costume overcan uh, because of why are you getting the triple bonus? Oh, because he has the tune, but you're using the right the right version of Overkan, I feel, uh, and Ukonen as well. So we're gonna try to take this on. Um, I want to use. Hold on, have I? Yeah. So I'm gonna try to use this team and see whether it works. So we do have counters for Ukonen. Uh, and hopefully uh, a good dispel for um, uh, for the right side as well, uh, right and left side, for that matter. If only we can get some good tiles here. Um, start with this. So you you can see the stats now: three three point one k, uh, three point nine k HP and 3.1k HP so the, the stats are crazy also with Okanen you have that true passive skill where status ailments that reduce defenses are 8% le less effective against this character which is why I didn't bring any um, heroes that give basically defense down because I feel that it would be not as effective uh, I might be wrong again uh, this is all testing but I just want to see how uh, how this works out so uh, looks like I won't be able to get uh, Garnet up in time for Ukonen, but I guess it's fine. We just want to test and see how annoying this can be. The good thing about uh, Fizz Coil and Timius is that they don't really mind. The damage doesn't really come from uh, their their special skill. It comes more from variants from Moonstrike as well as from the Wither effect. So uh, we're going to give it one more charge to get... No, I can't get uh, I can't get Garnet up, so I might as well just do this now. Okay. All right. So also the problem with this as well is um, they don't have they, they I can't dispel um, I can't dispel what do you call this openings. Uh, the Ukunen's counter attack here, which is going to be super annoying. Uh, but we can try. No, I can't do it. <laughs> so I'm actually dead right now because I can't use Face Coil and I can't use Timius. <laughs> They're all gonna die from the counter attack. Oh, this is a really annoying defense. Uh, yeah. So maybe just just to show like what the what the damage is like. So if I do this, and I do this, this guy is going to die. Uh, and just to see how much damage this deals, let's just show. So it's only 800, <laughs> it's only 800 something damage where usually you could go up to like uh, nine 900 I think on, uh, I think it's 900 damage on regular double limit broken without using legendary troops. So yeah, that's how strong it is. All right, we're dead here. So I think we're just gonna flee and, or well, die and come back. Yeah, let's come back and test this out again. Uh, we weren't getting our blue matches then, so let's try again. Uh, okay, this time we can have Garnet up as protection before. Uh, anything bad happens. Um, uh, 
Um, I'm inclined to get some blue matches up first. Let's try and get a blue match up. Use Garnet. Have some protection. Thousand three hundred damage. Look at that. Jeez, <laughs> crazy. All right. Uh, let's just do this first. See whether we can dispel some of the dodges. That's good. Let's bring this here. So they're not going to be able to get any more uh, additional counter attack stats, uh, stacks, or anything like that, which is good. Can sort of defend against this for the time being but it's also really annoying because oh, let's just do this because the stats are crazy I mean and he's healing all the time with that true passive skill giving him oh no it's not it's not this troop so there was there was another troop where every time he heals he gets 5% uh, extra health I don't think they I don't think they I think they're probably testing a different troop for him it's always good to see Hey, do we kill him? Nice. Oh my god, I don't know why did he charge so fast. Jeez. Alright, um sure let's just do this and see how much damage this goes. Kill this side. Oh, nice. Let's see if we can kill Obercon. I kind of want to kill Obercon here. Jeez. No counter attack for you, that's fine. Uh do I want to do I want to flee? I feel like hold on. Nine hundred and twenty five health. Yeah, he wouldn't die from this, I think. I think if Timius hits he probably wouldn't die. Uh but just to show you how resilient it is, three thousand nine hundred HP is crazy. Um It's gonna take a lot to kind of kill him. Let me just see how much damage this deals. I don't think it killed him. Oh, he kills. 949 to 1000. So we're going to flee and try a different team here. Uh, just want to see how how good the defense is using... Let's use another team. Um, assuming that we can run something like this in war. It's crazy. I still haven't decided if I want to convert do a quick conversion just to put just to put up a legendary troop in my defense but uh yeah i don't think it's needed right now all right we're gonna try another blue team uh same thing uh against ukanen i i like to have someone that can remove the undispellable effect on my blues so let's try and see and this time we don't have a dispel uh, at all so yeah let's just hope Okay. Um. That's a lot of damage. We shouldn't trigger Obercon. So you can see, like the mana itself is not going up that that much. It's except for this guy because this guy is has the costume bonus. So the mana is uh. Is going faster than Timius's, even though I, I think I hit Timius quite a bit less as well. So let's try and see how much damage they can take. So let's use let's use all on the left side here. 
700, 600, 600. Um, let's try and use the 100%er. Let's see how much damage this deals. Whoa! <laughs> All of them revived. Oh my god. Uh, okay, sure. Cool. Very cool. Okay, let's uh, let's give a little health boost first. Um, save yourself. No, I pressed wrong. Ooh, but look at the damage from. Uh, look at the damage from Gilad. That's crazy. Alright, heal it up. And I think let's see how much how many times can he revive? Nope. None. All right, so that goes to show just how just how much health <laughs> those um, how much health those legendary troops give, especially on a costume. So three thousand nine hundred. It's almost four thousand. Um, yeah, it's going to be really annoying, especially uh, if you have like a defense where you can run a few more costumes as well. It's going to be really annoying, especially with the fighter class. So yeah, that's my testing for Legendary Troops continued. We'll see what we can see in the future. Alright, catch you on the next one. GG. Mm -hmm.